Alright gamers, so of course we're back with another cool, awesome, easy game. Of course now it's for the um, ninth year actually. Um, Kalkin Blue Goku Evolution Blue Vegeta. I kinda didn't expect him to get an easy A, but also I was like, when the banner unit is usually featured on a banner or carnival, they um, are usually gonna get an easy A. So them, Broly can gain A or sub easy A. Broly is a parakeet. Bro 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 oh my god, Broly is a parakeet. Uh, Broly and Par Broly and oh, I cannot speak today. Broly and Paragus were also another easy A that was featured. And um, Broly Chiello, they're the part one easy A's. Of course, these are technically going to be the part two easy A's because they were announced during the um, live stream for part two. I got to make a whole separate video to talk about that, though. We should get their kit and details on the 14th. That's usually when they release. So, part two should be down here um, near Valentine's Day because that is what like, the next live stream. They're just when they show off their kits. I figured because part one had its own live stream, they didn't show off the kits. Then part two had its own live stream, didn't show off the kits yet. Like today, we had it uh, technically last night, about eight, nine, about 10, probably 11 hours ago at this point. No, actually, probably like 15 hours ago at this point. Um, been almost about a day now, so, um, half of a day. Um, but yeah, that's usually, um, usually how it is. So yeah, um, my brain kind of cooked up for a second. I was like, wait a second. But yeah, I wanted to make that video. I'm really excited to make that video. And my voice sounds a little beat up, a little out of it though. I just came outside like a few hours ago. I came from outside to walk, from walking my dog. And my brain, I can't speak right now because I'm, I'm just running off fumes right now. But yeah, of course, got the brand new EZA. Thank you to Duck and Fish, of course, for the EZA, of course. Oh, Google Trends actually got it right. Awakening, pay attention. <laughs> yeah, nice. I'm gonna give that as a title. And of course, we got some translations. Thank you to Chris, of course, always. Thank you for having out the ducking community. But yeah, I did Bears' sleeping video, sleeping Bears' video. I thought he was decent. But I'm gonna say that for that video. Of course, gonna go for Kyle Kim Blue Goku, Evolution Blue Vegeta, or Evo Ken. Even called that from like Legends. So a lot of people were calling it that. But yeah, let's go against our though, of course. Uh, so they do um, the new easy of course, this is the old leader skill to compare. This is the new leader skill, it's all in bold. Thank you to Chris for like, um, these beautiful translations. But yeah. See what they can do. Uh, so they do all struggle or um, joy forces key three. All sets at one seventy. Not too bad for L R E Z. They don't teach too much. They keep the first part of the passive. They add two, three little new things in there. Like another kind of sentence slash paragraph. That's pretty much it. Gotta expect this one as well. It's easy and simple. But yeah, because part one we had easy. This is technically part two is easy. So of course the twelve key. Uh, great raise attack and defense for one turn. Cost of damage to lower attack and defense. Eighteen key. Uh, raise raises attack and defense for one turn. Big cost of damage. Lowers attack and defense. Greatly lowers attack and defense actually. <clears throat> Okay, um, yeah, because this is how the retire was original. I want like one, it's pretty much one sentence long. Now they added a few more things here, which actually do. I'm, I'm looking at this so far. I only add like a passive, a, a extra passive um, um, support. So key four, attack defense at 170, randomly changes a certain type of key sphere to a rainbow. Um, key rainbow, oh yeah, the rainbow key spheres. When there's another superhero category ally on the team, plus an additional attack defense of 7%, free keys are obtained. Chance of performing a crit and reduces damage received by seven percent, and at key two, run, launch additional attack that's a uh, high chance of becoming a super attack. Up to three additional attacks within the turn, which also can technically be super attacks as well. Per 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 attain, I see him get like four. I see him get like three normal attacks. I see him get like two super attacks. I see him get like um. I see, I see like four, maybe five. I think I seen them do four super attacks. So of course, the original like super attack. The second one they got, and of course, like I said, I see I always see a second one. I see like a third one. They do like extra super attack sometimes. Like I said, they're pretty much like Kefla. Now, pretty much at this point, but you know, a lot less. But I mean, it's it kind of the same. If I can get get a good give a good comparison, per remote keys to retain. Um, get the general attack defense of save seven percent when keys eighteen or more. I always love that. Um, performs a, a crit when keys twenty four or more. 24 and one more time only, just didn't receive uh, by 7%, weight HP is 50% or below, which isn't that hard to kind of get because I know when King the Kalkin Blue Goku's passive, he can kind of get to that area with um, his. Um, that's where you get like his spirit bomb attack and um, kind of get it there with them. Like his spirit bomb attack, you kind of hit that threshold between 70 and like, I think 75 and like 50, but you can kind of heal up and kind of negate the passive. But of course, like the pack of passive goes a little bit up. Passive conditions usually stay the same. Categories and links still usually stay the same. So don't need to go over that too much, though. As they seem really, they seem amazing. Like they, they went from like, okay, when they first came out, like they were actually really good. But now they do so much more category support, more crit. Um, you know, this is always the same. this is the same because I think they originally you know, they had rainbow key spheres. They kept like this part of the passive when they get rainbow key spheres. You know, they do more attacks, which are the three the three additional attacks. They kept that the same. Like I said, they literally keep the passive the same relatively, but they do a lot for these guys, which they didn't need that support because I'm not saying they were bad before, but before the EZA, they were not runnable. They're taking damage, they can tank, but yeah, like I said now, again, again, even with this now new newer passive, they can, I guess, like help out. That was my problem was, you know, that the defense wasn't the best, but now that the EZA, now that they, you know, can get themselves out there more, 
Yeah, but like I said, they just took their run up on their past of that, like superhero category stuff. So a, a little extra crate. Oh, actually, yeah, I was like, they, yeah, it's pretty much what they did. They added superhero part and more key. Hmm, and a little bit more defense. Oh, yeah, of course, seven crates here because universe seven. I was seeing so far, I like their build though, honestly. I also love EZA builds like this support because it's usually like a kind of a sub, not a sub EZA, but sub EZA's we see how their, their passives are. They do a lot, but they um also support another category, which other EZA, I mean, a lot of EZA's like this one, like LR EZA's, and like um, your EZA's, like recently they're all different. They all have like category support and stuff like that. But this one though, I like it. It's a good balance. It's, it feels like a sub EZA, but also adding a few new little new nuances and touches, which I really do like that. I really do like that within this unit, though. I really do like that. That's actually really, really good. But yeah, though, honestly, huh? Yeah, not too bad for them, though. Again, like the categories and links are gonna be good. Like Universe Seven, of course, or Universe Universe Seven, Universe of Oz, of Saga. Uh, I think they're on Pure Saiyans. I believe so. But like I said, you have a lot of good team options with them, so they're gonna be good no matter where you go. But like I said, and I Realm of Gods. I still want some more Realm of Gods team, though. Like with the new leader skills and everything nowadays. They're really good, and they're all superheroes, so... Oh, superheroes, sorry. Um, yeah, they have a lot of good potential, holy crap. I love easy as like this, like said, support, they can um, support themselves. Uh, I say financially, they can, yeah, they can actually, they're, I mean, they're raking in the money anyway. Uh, <laughs> yeah, maybe with the purple stone anyway. But yeah, though, like what I'm seeing so far. I'm liking what I'm seeing, I'm liking what I'm seeing. I am liking what I'm seeing. They're self-sufficient, they support um, other categories, they support each other, they give them some more defense. I can like say, they didn't need, need to really do too much, of course, give them crit. I mean, they already had put some crit before, but, you know, they have a more, uh, they, have, can, they can do a little bit more with that crit that they have, honestly. Yeah, not bad so far, not bad. I don't really got nothing else to say, though, honestly. They're great. They're really, really great, honestly. Again, I know, like, oh my gosh, LRUZA is blah blah blah, but I did praise over Draco because EZA. I praised over the side units EZA. I did, uh, someone actually did point out, they, my comment section, yes, I'm calling you out. Um, person I haven't commented yet, I'm calling you out because they really love Chila and Lemo. And, um, Chila was his favorite characters, and he's, he was glad to see him, like, you know, more. Again, we already knew they were going to be busted, the LR Chila, Lemo, and Broly EZA. We knew they were going to be disgusting and busted. But overall, though, honestly, as well, uh, um, yeah, like, legit, like, this is another good EZA. Like part one had a good e countdown, had a good EZA. Part uh, no, no, I meant to say it's actually yeah. Uigo because it wasn't a count. He was a part one. He was a countdown. The actual EZA from the celebration were Broly, Chile, and Lemo. These guys, of course, are technically part two. Um, and the sub EZA is a product in GNA or product in GNA. Everyone pronounced it. Broly and Paragus and Broly and Chile and Lemo. They're technically women part one. So yeah, that makes sense. More sense though. But yeah, though, I mean, so far EZA is this year. And in general, you know, anniversary always got to go all out. But in general, though, honestly, they did really good. They did really, really good. Honestly, I can really just praise them. Like the teams are going to be on the categories that metal they're going to help out. And nowadays, is going to be really, really good. You also, I also have to factor that in a lot with these EZAs and stuff like that. Like what the other good doing the modern day teams, other teams, their other old teams. How they going to be sufficient with that? How they going to build like with their um old kids and stuff like that? Like how they going to build with this new era? Like what they're going to do in these new teams? Like they we don't know. That's the fun part about these good easy A's. Like, do we have no idea what they're gonna do? This easy A is a good one, and I think it's always anniversary. Oh, is because uh, again, they pretty much what I wanted them to be support for our category, support for e for each other. Add a little bit more extra. That's all I had to do for me. That's all I needed for easy A. I mean, it's, it, it's the point of easy A to make it nowadays and modern for the modern day, you know, era and everything. But not even easy A's so good. Str during universe six sub easy A's with chomp physical chomp, but he sucks. Uh, for Power Frost, he sucks. Bottom Magetta, he sucks. Yeah, Jiren, SDR Jiren, he sucks. You know, he's the mainline EZA, but he just sucks. But yeah, like I said, they're just C Duke and just. Whew, and again, they always play this month in advance, but also I just. I, I cannot gloss over it. It's amazing and I love it all. It's beautiful. Yeah, I have no more. I have no more, no more work to say. It's, it's a really good EZA. But yeah, pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go today. But yeah, though, see you guys later, though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Great love. Focal training. Get them. Make sure I stay safe. Wash hands. Go bust all of you. Go on top and wear a mask. I'm talking about the YouTube. Give us if you can. Go on to subscribe and copy them. Shout out my friends on the Discord. Show if you're great. Go so awesome. Wake up the cabal. It's a full of course. If you like to hit it, get very simple, very easy like, video, like I said, though, today. Uh, but yeah, go, go, ahead, go ahead and report the, 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 the part two stuff. Then this one in the pajama beers video is pretty simple and easy to break down. Just really easy. I have nothing else to say. Really excited for the third video I'm going to record. I haven't recorded the um, part two LO reveals yet. But yeah, I'm excited for that, though. That's the first one's going to go up. This one, I'll do this one, pajama beers, and I like these guys. Or I might do that one, this, then pajama beers.
Yeah, that seems good. See you guys in the weekend, though. Peace out.